so this is part of the PewDiePie anthropology and we're gonna watch three videos one of those is Crazy Girl Siren Blood uh, Chorus I'm Not Mad The Unfair Platform Platformer and Story Behind PewDiePie uh, I think they I choose them and I skip a lot of videos because uh, I just realized that it makes no sense to watch them all to really see how he was evolving and I probably will jump to December the next video so uh, let's watch them there there seems to be cool and see how they are ba -ba -da -ba -da. here through with this game and the story just took a giant turn I wanted to recap and explain the story how I understand it so far so basically the story begins in the deep mountains of Japan there's a ritual going on two girls are going to be sacrificed some people heads are covered there's a shaking that's going on said by Melissa this girl she sees the ritual by coincidence along with her TV group Howard Wright a young high school student who's also there by coincidence sees the first girl getting killed and interrupts the ritual helping Miyako the other girl who's going to be sacrificed escape they later find each other in the game and fall hopelessly in love with each other true love right right Right! Mm. They then meet up with Ciego, who reminds them that the girl is cursed and her fate is to be sacrificed in the ritual either way. Oh, it's true. He lets her go because he knows that she can't escape her destiny even if she tries to escape it. We know it, we all know it, you know it. Alright. Amana tries to help the high school guy. Howard doesn't trust her because she's wearing the ritual costume. Amana persists, however, and explains to him that the sightseeing ability that he now has is a gift from the gods to keep him safe. Amana doesn't seem to understand what the gods want from her. What is it you ask of me? But finding clues from the past hinting wake up she later realizes that she's evil and she's immortal she needs to resurrect her evil god and she realizes that she shouldn't have helped Howard from the beginning I have to perform the ritual again. well the story is good let's see and jump Shibita. Do you cat? Hey, what's up? <laughs> Alright, can we uh, fuck with this? Well, that was an mission. You're welcome, my black friend. Shit. I in business. We are. So, at this time, he was living in Italy. I uh, guess Marcia was living in um, her family home, not with him. Uh, uh, because she's Italian. I don't know. Uh, in my understanding, Italian are not that progressive. But let's keep seeing. was interesting the game itself uh, for me not that much maybe for someone that's a game lover it is and now let's say um, I'm not mad the unfair My platform <laughs> welcome to the unfair platform and Jesus Christ this intro song is terrible um it's pretty famous just like Cat Mario if you remember that game oh yeah how the fuck does he jump anyway? It looks stupid. Okay, there we go. That was close! Stupid game, this is a trap. Well, that means it's probably a. But so is that. <laughs> God damn it! Alright, so far, not so bad. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. okay with it. Hop! Blah! There we go. Also, this game has traps in it. Thank you for top. <laughs> Wonderful! Wonderful! This is fine. Cat Mario. Uh, this game has nothing on Cat Mario. Nothing. This is bullshit. All right. Blue flags are checkpoint. All right. Cool. Hallelujah. Okay. 
Do it's that. fucking easy. Okay, this is going. <laughs> this one is the most difficult one. She slides like a fucking pussy. There we go. Uh, At least I don't have the fucking sound. Let's go. Watch this. I would like. I would like. Um, I, I know it's mean, but this game is mean. No, oh, I missed my opportunity. Not good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I wonder if that was Italian or Spanish. Alright, I gotta check. Whoop! No! 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 <laughs> Fuck you! Stop killing me! Stop! Fuck you! Okay, I'm alive. What can kill me? Let's go a little forward. Like, what the fuck am I supposed to. Fuck all of you. Oh! No! No! <laughs> That was actually fun. <laughs> Come on. I was so happy. <laughs> Fuck you, game. Eh, 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 uh, 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 uh. Hope you enjoyed uh, the uh, answer platform. I actually did. Let me go and see. This one, it's called Story Behind PewDiePie Q&A Friday with PewDiePie Part 47. What? You know, you know what, bros? It's Saturday. Fucking Saturday, not Friday. <laughs> uh, you have very funny fingers. This one, especially. It's like very chubby fingers and joke nails. Yeah, fuck. You know, you know what, bros? It's Saturday. Fridays with PewDiePie. A little history lesson for you, bros, today. Uh, I started this maybe over a little over a year ago because when I play video games, I feel like. So, this is 2012, so Fridays with PewDiePie is from 2011. This is when he was already making a living about, uh, from playing video games. Yes, that's fun, but it doesn't that doesn't give me any chance to connect with you, bro. So basically, every week I'm like, what the fuck am I supposed to do for Fridays? And I'm always like, oh, it's Friday is coming. And then eventually I just ran out of fucking time to do something, so... My apologies, bros. I'm eating this, by the way. Swedish bee like, Have you ever tried this? Hey, hey, try one, try one. Is it good? Okay, so we're gonna have a QA. and a I ask you bros on Facebook. You can ask me whatever you want. Isn't that cool? Alexi Haikinen, what's your favorite sandwich? The one that your mama makes. <laughs> what's your favorite video game character? Uh, Sho Minamimoto, I think it's called. He's a character from The World Ends With You. He's really funny. So is that a slow? So is that a slow? Joel Sebastian Isaac, do you know that Argentina loves you? I wasn't aware of that, but it, that makes me happy. Uh, I remember when we studied um, countries in uh, South Africa, we, I chose Argentina, so you know, we have a special bond going on. Marie Hagebergett, why do you call yourself PewDiePie? It's a long story, it's based on different events. Basically, um, I just put pew from lasers pew, pew, and die together and we have PewDie and then I forgot my password to my PewDie account, so I had to die because I usually say pew when I was playing video games as a fun thing and people thought it was funny and it could just kind of catch on okay Jesus Christ what a fucking question what do you ask so many fucking questions huh what do you want from me oh, I'm sorry I'm sorry come on Liao why are you so dang funny man I don't really think I'm that funny you are I'm sorry oh I you are strange that I have to give you that 
Andrew Zorawa, you are very funny, you're silly. And I would create uh, educating in your family, or you develop that for yourself. Um, I think it's thanks to you, bros. Um, you know, it's thanks to you, bros, that I can do charities in the first place. Uh, if I was alone, uh, you know, I could still participate in other charities, but I couldn't org I don't think I could organize in the same... There's something funny about his mustache, he's got one piece missing here. Like, there's no mustache here. What the fuck, bro? Scale, at least. Uh, so, it's, it's, it's thanks to you, bros, and I think it's really amazing. So far, last year we... I think it was like four and I can and uh, I feel lucky to be where I am. No. Care <laughs> they? People have been saying that you only care about money. Is this true? So that comes pretty early on his career. Okay, so it's an old meme. Um, I think I, I always try my best when, with what I do and I'm happy that things have really gone so well but yeah, I think that's it. Thank you. Uh, that's it for today. Bye.